everybody, j and A Review, and today we're at Great American RV here in Huntsville, Alabama. If you just found our channel, go ahead and subscribe, follow along with us, and give us a thumbs up. Today we're going to be looking at an Airstream International 2024 model number 23FB. So let's get started. The length on this International is 23 feet, the dry weight is 4,806 pounds, and that hitch weight is 439. Woo, yes, guys, we're going to apologize for the wind. It is blowing wide open out here, but we're going to go across um, and get the front here real quick. Your propane, of course, is going to go up here in this container. Uh, we may have to we may have to have two people to operate this, but you've got some storage right here at the front. I'm not sure how well that's going to show up. It's a little dark. Okay. Your batteries are going to go down here in this box. Uh, let's go around the other side real quick. You do have a little bit of outside storage right here. Great place to store your power core. Yes. You see that is um, dual axles here. You're going to have an outside shower. Now the Airstream gives you an awning on both sides. We're not sure what the length is. But the whole thing is 20, 23 feet. feet, so this awning's got to be at least 20 because it goes pretty and of much course, the whole that length. Will just cover up your window. Yeah, it covers your windows. Back here, you actually have a little bit of storage here on this bumper. There we go. Just like that. And that's, I think that's your awning. Real, isn't it? I think it is yeah. to operate your awning. Yeah. So you're also going to have an awning here on your campsite. Uh, again, it goes pretty much the whole length of the Airstream. And you're going to have another little compartment right out here for storage. Okay, let's go inside where the wind is not blowing so we can show you this super little Airstream. quick look around here All right. now if this is going to be great if you have a half ton truck um, definitely going to be half ton towable but let's uh, let's start up here at the front you're gonna have twin beds I think you can convert this to one large bed but don't hold me to that i'm not absolutely uh, sure i'm not real sure this either. one you may not be able but you do have twin beds i love the twin beds <laughs> you've got this really great windshield here and of course you can push your curtains all the way around and seat. open the whole front nice. up above you've got this neat little storage area that slides there we go. Both ways. It's lit, which is really yes. cool. Um, I'll go ahead and point up. You're going to have this large fan, and it's got a shade, too, so you can actually close that out. In between your beds, you have this awesome nightstand with a drawer, and this box is going to have all your little goodies in it, remotes and things like that. And underneath the beds, you have these... And this one's got a tray. Look at there. And this one has, it's got a tray under it also. Yep, I just can't reach it. <laughs> now we're going to swap sides because the other side's a little bit different. It has okay. three compartments. Oh, wow. So, yeah, a little small one here. Oh. And then that one up there's got a got you know, little thing. storage pan. And you've got an access panel under here. Yep. So, cool. really good storage in here. Also, right up here, you're going to have a hanging area. And this is right at the foot of one bed. And I'm going to come in here and turn around. Slow, so I won't make anybody dizzy. Nice window over here. And you're going to have a smart TV mounted up here now this will completely swivel all the, all way, the way around way. so you can see it from your dinette so awesome little bedroom and your controls for your ac is back here is right back here 
Oh, and there's also some storage down here at the foot of this bed. And you do have got a privacy curtain. A privacy curtain that you can pull. Yep. Okay. Now the airstreams don't have a slide, so um, sorry. We may have to maneuver just a little bit to get through this one, but it's actually great, great head height in here. Yeah. You're gonna have this U-shaped dinette. Um, this will let down to make an additional sleeping area. Mm -hmm. um, just he just slides yep. right down. Pull these down. Yes. Okay. And then you got another great. Yes, more of the sliding storage area up here. And at this end, do I see a plug-in? Yes. There we go. Yes. Plug-in and all kinds of ports for stuff up here. Cool. Neat little reading lights in here. Um, these windows, of course, they will pop out for airflow. You've got the pull down blinds. Also, in here, you have another little storage cubby right there. All right, I'm gonna turn around and see if I can get this wardrobe here open for you. Very nice wardrobe with a light in here, hanging, great space. All the way down. Right next to that, you have a pull-up. This is not very deep. Um, actually, a cereal box would probably fit up here. Just great. Mm -hmm. Of course, your AC unit's going to be right here in the middle. Um, let me turn around again. This is going to have. Is this a 12 volt fridge? I would think so. And your freezer is at the bottom and your fuses are down here at the floor because we've got solar running right now yes yeah yes all right i'm going to stand over here so we can show you the kitchen area <clears throat> another one of these great storage spaces with the sliding doors and all of these are backlit which yeah just which just looks so cool and you've got the three burner furion yes and with a Little convection, convection. microwave. And let's pull down storage there. And let's see what else we got here. Storage here. Hey! Yeah. And there is an access panel also under that. Oh, drawers. Super nice. And these do have solid surface countertops. So your sink here is going to be a big. Ooh. Pretty good size stainless steel sink. And you have these, I mean, instantly recognizable little Airstream windows. And it does have, it does have the shade, so you can yeah. pull that. But hold on. <laughs> Up here at the top. Okay. You've got another little neat storage area. And then something that I think you guys are going to love. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, you have this little pull-out pantry spice rack. Wow. So cool. All right. We're going to finish it off right back here at the very back. It's going to be where the bathroom is. Big window and it will open. So you've got a plug in right there. Uh, nice big counter space around your sink. Storage down below the sink. And you've got a little sliding compartment right here. Yep either side. Stacks of toilet paper in there. Yes. A little open cutting. Okay. I'm going to tell you something. Kind of on my tippy toes. <laughs> yeah. Now, now, now the toilet placement has me a little bit, a little bit confused there. It's a little bit tall, but while you're there, here, let me hand you this. And here's the shower. There you go. Let me drop all this in here. Well, hey. Well, now Jeremy is six feet tall, so I mean, if you're any taller, you you may have to make some um, different arrangements. But yeah, and it has some little storage down there for your shampoo to keep it from going around. You have a clothes rack. Hey. So hey, also here in the bathroom, I didn't point this out, but you have a little vanity mirror that's included. And your towel rain. So And you got a towel holder on the back uh, of Yes, the towel rack's already here. Uh, let's see, it looks like your tank monitors are in here and your water heater. 
So, wow. Again, Airstreams are new for us. Um, so we're, we're learning all of these neat little storage compartments that they have. Got a little and a dry erase, erase board, board. Little hooks here, little keychain holders up here. I'm telling you, this is a neat little unit. All right, everybody, if you like this Airstream, the dealership's information will be down in our description. And like always, if you just found our channel, go ahead and subscribe, follow along with us, and give us a thumbs up. Thanks, everybody.